All right, Shay, thank you. Now it is time to think about Utah children in need of a toy during the holiday and Christmas season. Toys for Tots Drive going on. ABC4 Utah, proud to be part of it. That's right. You can donate a new unwrapped toy in any Toys for Tots collection box. There are several participating businesses, including Walgreens. You can even drop them off right here at the station. That's 2175 West 1700 South. And we've been down at Valley Fair Mall for one special one day only Toys for Tots drive with U.S. Marines. That is also where Kylie Burse is right now. She's in for Chief Meteorologist Jim Kosick, hanging out tonight with the Marines and everybody else who apparently is in costume because I can see him behind you, Kylie. <laughs> Oh, we're having a lot of fun here, too. They were just dancing a second ago. Looks like they're starting to pick up again. They're here helping encourage everyone to donate to this amazing cause. And as you can see, we've filled up several boxes already, which is great news. These are all going to Utah kids who otherwise wouldn't have gotten any toys for Christmas. So just an amazing, amazing cause. We'll be here until 630 if you have time to come down and shop and pick out a toy and say hi to a stormtrooper, too. <laughs> and we also are accepting donations here as well. And every time those doors open, open it is so cold out there so brave the cold temperatures come on down we do have some good news a warming trend and i say that lightly because we aren't warming up a whole lot i'll have more in my seven day forecast and we'll talk more about toys for tots in just a bit back to you all right thanks kylie you're watching utah's most accurate forecast with kylie burse Another cold night out there. I'm Kylie Burst in tonight for Chief Meteorologist Jim Kosick. We are live here at Valley Fair where we are collecting toys for Tots, a Good for Utah event. And we've been seeing a lot of people just drop off these toys. Now I'm here with Staff Sergeant Mondragon and you've done this for three years now. Tell me a little bit about why you're so passionate about this cause. Um, like I said, just over the last three years, just seeing a bunch of families, you know, just just their expressions collecting toys, especially the needy ones. You know, you get some teary-eyed parents here and there. and. You know, it, it, it feels good. It makes you, like I said, it makes you feel good. Yeah, it's the spirit of giving. And we've had some pretty cool donations here today, not only toys, but some pretty big cash donations as well. Yeah, apparently this morning, this lady dropped about $1,200 in cash, and that was pretty amazing to hear. I heard the story. Unfortunately, I wasn't here, but it had been, some, it had been a sight to see. Yeah. But overall, a great day here? Uh, it looks awesome. I like the support, you know, with the characters behind us, or, you know, it's just, yeah, it's, it's different. Yeah. <laughs> It's been a lot of fun out here. Oh, the stormtroopers, they're back. And I kind of wish I had one of those outfits and definitely not this one because you must be absolutely frigid right now. It is so cold outside. So let's get to those temperatures and how low those temps are going to go. And, oh, the door just opened again. We are feeling it. It is so cold outside. So make sure as you are out there, you bundle up and, you know, take the time. Donate a toy if you can. We're looking for 13 years old and under for these toys. And again, you can donate them at Walgreens. And of course, stop by the ABC4 studio. We'd love to say hi during business hours. Live in West Valley City, Kylie Burst, ABC4 Utah. How can anyone pass you up as well as some dancing stormtroopers? Yeah, I really. mean, <laughs> don't see that every day. <laughs> exactly. All right, thanks, Kylie.